morning. Nice day for it. So what we're going to do today, because I want it in easy days, but we're going to do this. We go into the, remember that? The nice raised bed and a dog's wrecked it. So, I'm going to try and dog proof it. So let's see how this goes. First up, gloves on. Shut up. I see. Probably a nine. Fixing a actually not too bad. Just topped it up. It's where it sunk with the rainy weather. I'm going to attempt to put M4 sticks in each corner, followed by some netting around it, held on. With them things, what are they called? Anyway, them things. I can't believe I forgot what they're called. Anyway, looks better. And if the dogs do knacker this up, well, I'll find some help, won't I? Better, it looks fantastic. A bit of electric electric fence around that, they won't go anywhere near it, will they? Here we go again. Netting. Cable ties. That's what them things were called. Cable ties. 
already I've had a dog sitting in it. I've not even finished it yet. Yeah, put them in. Cable tied them around there because they didn't want to drill any holes in it. It's looking half good, isn't it? A bit better than that one. But yeah. Already, dog sat in it. That one over there, Lucy. Lucy! Yes, you. Knob. She's not really, she's a good girl. Just a bit of a knob. Right, next I'm going to put some of this shade cloth around it. Then go inside and pray and watch for dogs. And there we have it. Hopefully dog proof so we can grow something to eat in there. You reckon it's going to be dog proof? Anybody's guess? So yeah, I'll let you know. Tune in to the next episode of Sod This, I Hate Gardening. Culprit. Aren't you? Loose? You getting right getting my raised beds? Are you? Water wouldn't melt. Ah, oh, you being good. Never happens.